Greetings, programs. This is Wretch. Welcome back to the Blackwell Legacy. And I'm really liking that song playing from the radio. But in the last episode, guys, we were able to find out that Ali really liked dogs. And after a little bit of figuring out what to do and drugging a dog, <laughs> we were able to convince Ali that she had passed on and helped her move on to the next life. But we still have Susan to consider here in Bellevue um, being still tormented by the deacon so visitor hours are over and we're gonna have to try and find some way to get the key from the guard joey can joey, you come here a sec what do you want sweetheart oh we can actually talk to joey here normally he would give out about that what was it like staying here like i was on a different floor but it's all the same 25 friggin' years, hovering over your aunt's shoulder, staring at the ceiling. You want to know how many cracks there were in that ceiling? Not really. I 54. do. Thank you. Maybe 55. I was never sure about that last one. How well did you know Dr. Quentin? That quack. He'd come into your aunt's room, poke her, prod her, try to get her to speak. He didn't know from nothing. I'd just as soon never see him again. What was Auntie's condition like? She was a rotting vegetable, sweetheart. They kept her so drugged up that she could hardly move. Which is probably for the best, come to think of it. Without the drugs, she uh, wasn't pretty. But the doc told you all about that. You don't need to hear it again from me. That's all for now. Right, right. Okay, that didn't really help our situation any. Um... I assume... Can we just grab the keys? Whoa! Hold on there. Said no. I'm not stealing stuff from the hospital. Whoa! Hold on there. You wanna go in, I gotta clear you first. What was that? Fuse box key? I could probably do something with this. Oh, Joey. You champion. Did we literally just get the key just now? Oh. Need to take advantage of the fact that Joey's presence can do interesting things. Now you've done it. You better find a place to hide quick. Wait, I, okay. Well, boo. We need to find a place to hide. Locked. Whatever's back there, I can't get to it. Maybe in this little alcove? Let's try. Oops. Did not mean to do that. Well, you don't get in too much trouble doing this. I hope you know what you're doing, doll. You better find a place to hide quick. Little phone alcove. Whoa, you startled me. You'd better leave, miss. I can't be held liable for your safety until the lights are repaired. I'll get the elevator for you. Thanks. Hmm. Okay. It's really fast, though. Hmm. Oh, that's actually closed off now. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh! It's like Blair Witch! Run, run, run! She's asleep. Yeah, like a baby. It won't be long. Before what? 
Before that. Oh, it's literally a deacon. Please. Please. Can't you help me? Please. I don't know what to do. I don't want to burn. Please. The others are gone. You're the only one. Please. You can't hear me here, but you can hear me in your dreams. Please. Wake, Wake up, up and help, help me! Oh man. So... Subtle interjection. Ahem. Ignore them, Susan. Listen to me. Help, help me. me. Please! Please. Watching, waiting, Susan, Susan, you called me, you can help, help me. Hey! Ignore them, Susan, listen to me, help, help me, me. Please. please! I'm talking to you, clown shoes. You're, you're talking to me? Yeah, so can you calm down long enough to tell me what's going on? I, I can't. You're like me. What do you mean? Dead, like, like me. me. Wait a minute, just a goddamn minute. You know you're dead? Yes. yes. Well, that certainly saves time. We can help you. Here, grab a hold of this. No, no. get that away no, from me. From what the hell is wrong with you? You need saving, we're here to save you. What's the problem? I can't. What are you so scared of? You're stuck, right? We can help you move on. No. I don't, I don't want, want to. to. You don't want to? No, I... I'm afraid. Oh, you're afraid, are you? You believe this guy? Well, Joey said that uh, other cases were going to be more complicated. What do you want? Safety. Sanctuary. It's following me. Waiting. Watching. Trying to take me. But it hasn't caught me yet. Not yet. Yeah, whatever. This guy's off his nut. Let me handle this baby doll. I know how to speak to spooks like this. I want more information. What hasn't caught you? It. It. Pennywise? See it everywhere. In every shadow. In every corner. Why is it after me? Why? The soft touch ain't gonna cut it, sweetheart. You're too green. Let me show you how it's done. Who is after you? It! It! it. Haven't you ever seen him? Forget it, kid. He isn't listening. We're wasting our time. He knows he's dead. We don't need kid gloves to handle this. Let me take over. Sure. Do it your way. All right, Mac. Spill. You've scared these girls literally to death, and I want to know why. What are you so afraid of? I... I don't, don't want to burn. Burn? Oh, oh, I get it. You think you're going to hell. It's the devil himself. He told me. Please don't make me go. You're scared of the devil, huh? Yes! Yeah, well, I don't see any devil. There's just you and me. And you know what? Oh God. I'm worse than any devil you'll ever see. Hey! I've been doing this for 40 years, bucko. Every ghost I meet goes to their final rest one way or the other. You're scared? I don't give a rat's ass. Two people are dead because of you. So take the damn tie and let's get this over with. No! You can't, you can't make, make me. me. Don't, don't make, make me burn, burn. please! <sighs> Hurts, don't it? How? Oh. Ghosts aren't supposed to feel pain, but I've learned some tricks. Now take the damn tie. Joey, stop it. Give her a chance. Handle it your way. Oh, we're dupli- as Joey. Let's give her a chance. We- I mean, we've got to- You want to handle this? Go right ahead. Let's see you do any better. 
try and give hope, talk about running, try the guilt card. I don't know how to... What would be the best way to go about this? Because he's so obsessed with running from the devil, essentially, that he doesn't seem to care what he did. Hmm. Let's try the guilt card first. You killed two people. Almost killed a third. Doesn't that mean anything to you? They called me. Why would they call me? If they couldn't help me. Yeah, that didn't work. I'm taking over. So, are we going to do this the easy way? Oh, wow. Or the hard way? Please. No. What are you going to do to me? Please don't make it get me. I don't want to go to hell. Hell schmell. You want to stop talking crap? Hey, stop. Let me talk to him, okay? You want to handle this? Go right ahead. Let's see you do any better. Let's try a different tact. I know a safe place. You can hide there. Really? Where is it? Not far, but you'll have to trust us. Trust you? Why should I trust you? Hmm. Because nobody else has offered to help you before, right? Yeah. You ask and ask for help, but nobody answers, right? No. Nobody answers. Well, we have. We're gonna help you. Has anybody else said the same? No. No, they haven't. I think... Oh, I'm so tired of running. If you say you can help me, I believe you. What needs to be done? Just listen to my friend. Here, just take the tie. That. You know what to do. I can't believe she pulled that off. Yeah, but now we're gonna have him in our head. Ow. Convince the deacon to move on without violence. You were right. I feel safe. Are you ready? Yes. I really think so. It's really nice out here. Almost like... Like... At last, I have found you. Oh, God. No! You lied to me! What? It's here! You lied! What's that? Oh, crap! Joey? Joey! Get me out of here! Dealing with Tim Curry here. Stay away! There is nowhere to go. You cannot return to the mortal world. You can only go through me. Accept the punishments for your sins and come with me. Help me, please. You brought me here. You have to save me. You have to. Fool, no one can save you now. I'll give you a moment to prepare for the eternity to come, but then you are mine. Uh, what is that thing? It's come to take me to hell, just like it always said it would. Okay, wait, can we chat with the demon? We have a cobblestone. Uh, excuse me. Converse with me not. I shall give him time to prepare himself for the eternity to come. But then, he is mine. Uh. Why are you after this man? For his sins. All this time, he has not renounced them. Even after these many years of death, he still carries them with him. How did you get here? What is here? It is but an abstract concept to one such as I. I move at the power of thought, at the speed of death. Once my business is concluded, I shall trouble you no more. 
Can't you just let him go? He has killed many with his madness. His sins weigh him down even as we speak. Ask yourself, does he deserve mercy? Uh, uh, um, sure. Yes? You may think so, but your heart does not believe it. You have witnessed the results of his actions with your own eyes. What is the... We saw, I saw this on the floor when we were talking to Al... Oh! Sorry. What's going on here? What is that thing? I... Don't... Know! It haunted my dreams when I was alive. And wouldn't leave me alone after death. And now... There's no place left to run. Why is he chasing you? What did you do, Ray? What are your sins? What have you done? I don't know. Please, God, I don't know. I didn't mean to kill those people. It's just I've been so scared and I don't know why. Please help. What is that in your pocket? My flask. Yeah, what's in it? Nothing. It's just a force of habit, I guess. Used to keep whiskey in it when I was alive. It comforts him. So what can I do? What does he want? He wants me. I don't know why. Uh, our notes here? Oh. The deacon is carrying his sins. And the deacon is carrying his flask. Could this be symbolic? Oh, like Marley's chains. Get rid of that flask. Huh? Your flask! Get rid of it! My flask? Why? Just do it! But, but I can't. Why not? Because it, it's my flask. You want to be free of that demon? Trust me. Oh, oh, okay. You no longer carry your sins with you, dead one. But they still taint this place. That is not enough to save you. What do we do? Examine the flask more closely? There's nothing really special about it except that it belonged to a ghost. It's kind of vibrating. Smash the flask with the stone. It is done. The sins have been abolished from this place. And my claim on you, dead one, is gone. Move on in peace and be troubled no more. Bye, Tim Curry. He's gone? I think so. He's gone. I'm, I'm free of him. I'm really free. All this time, it's all so clear to me now. Like my head was full of cobwebs and now they're gone. I... All those people who died, they killed themselves because of me. Um, analyze? It seems like something Rosa would do. And what do you think about that? I don't know. I didn't know what I was doing. But that doesn't excuse it. I spent most of my life as a drunk. And most of my death as a murderer. I was worried about going to hell before. Maybe I'm okay with that now. Now that I know I might deserve it. Wow. Um... Maybe you can still redeem yourself. Maybe. Eventually. But not right now. You see, I was a religious man once. Before disease took my wife away, and I took to the bottle. If I'm going to hell, well then maybe I can still spread the word of God there. Do some good for once. Well, this is it. Goodbye. And thanks. What a thought. Preaching in hell. So there's a lot of symbolism we have to deal with. Jesus Christ, kid, you all right? Yeah, yeah, I'm fine. What took you so long? It got a little complicated. Well, I'm just glad you're okay. Let's get out of here. I need some air. I know the perfect place. 
And we were dealing with the opposite of Jesus Christ. He's oh. in peace now, I guess, wherever he is. I saved him, I think. Gave him some hope, at least. He's getting no more than he deserves. No more than any of us deserve. I guess. I really wished I could have popped him one more time. He really hacked me off. Is that your answer to everything? Don't you start judging me. You managed to pull it off. I'm impressed. Just glad you're okay. Joey? Yeah? Why did Auntie stop? Stop what? Stop doing this. This ghost saving or whatever it is we do. Oh. Uh, it was you. Me? She wanted to take care of you. Wanted to do it right, she said. Stop listening to me. Stop saving the ghosts. Just put all her effort into taking care of you. And then she fell into that weird coma. Yeah. I see. I guess there's a lesson in that. Is there? Yeah. Medium well done. Finish the game at least once. Hey! That was very interesting. I imagine the kind of thoughts that's going through Rosa's mind right now, knowing that all the thoughts she had for her aunt when her aunt was the one... Like, she was the reason that all the bad stuff happened to her aunt in a way. Yeah, if this is like a taste of what's to come. I'm really liking it. I like Joey. Um, I like the 19, or the detective kind of vibes. I also like the fact that he has a bit of a dark side to him. Rose is still trying to figure him out. Yeah, I see nothing but good stuff here. I was kind of interested. I was wondering if the deacon had done anything bad in his real life, like if he had killed anyone, but what an interesting take on the afterlife. Yeah, really digging this. So, um, what we're going to do, guys, is anytime I have a lull in the recording schedule, we're going to go ahead and play a Blackwell game. Oh, we got Rebecca Whitaker as Rosangela. Abe Goldfarb as Joey. They all kind of look similar, too. I like that. Chen Yung uh, Su. Jennifer Asteris. I like these as credits. Thomas Tucker as Adrian Tucker. Ruth Weber as Nashanti. Yeah, we didn't have a whole lot of interaction with Dr. Quentin. Oh, Francisco as the hospital guard. That's awesome. He did uh, Lamplight City. John Swist as the deacon. And who played the dog? Oh, Matt Gardner as Jim Birdo. Dave played the demon. <laughs> Dave Dotson as Bob. Ah, no dog credits. Yeah, I, you know, when it comes to some of these worlds, you only have one chance to make a first impression. And... Yeah, give thanks to coffee. Lots of it, I understand. I'm looking forward to the next one, guys. Special, special activation code Bright Eyes, huh? It's probably the... Oh, that's the old Wadget Eye Games logo. Yowza. There's hundreds of confused spirits out there, sweetheart. And there's nobody else who can help them. There's just us. Bestowing eternity on every sob story out there, one lost soul at a time, whether we want to or not. And there they are. Yeah, definitely going to check out the other stuff. Oh, wow, the game just like closed. <laughs> all right. So, yeah, we'll go ahead and end it here and we'll see you all next time we decide to play one of these. If y'all like the series, please leave a like down below, subscribe to the channel, leave a comment, that'd be a big help, and we'll see you in the next series. Later days, everyone.